The singularity is a point in the future, much like the renaissance of the past, where knowledge and technology begins increasing at an exponential rate. The rate of increase will be such that current civilization will more closely resemble the Stone Age than the direction we are heading towards. The renaissance was created by the gathering of genius philosophers to revise ideas of the time. It is widely agreed that with us reaching the limit of human genius, the singularity will instead be influenced by fully developed artificial general intelligence. To a large extent, Vivi explores these ideas. The anime begins after humanity has already reached the singularity. AI has already been integrated into society using a collective aggregate database known as the Archive. Vivi awakens as the first ever autonomous AI. She is able to witness the destruction of the human race by the very same Archive enabled AI. But that dystopian idea is only one interpretation of the results of the singularity. Hello everyone, welcome to Aniprop. Like the video and subscribe if you're interested, let's get into this. Other than the point in time, a singularity can also be defined by the Penrose singularity. This is the physical point in a black hole where all gravitational points converge. At the singularity, there is infinite gravity and no concept of time. A Penrose singularity is therefore the end of time. This is appropriate for Vivi Fluorite Eyes' song, as she is tasked with the singularity project. It has one purpose, and that is to prevent the destruction of the human race by interfering with historical events so that the timeline does not converge on the singularity point. Vivi does this with the assistance of Matsumoto, an AI sent back from the future. In this way, the anime plays out a lot like 12 Monkeys the TV show or the Terminator films where entities are sent back in time to prevent specific events which lead to future destruction. So, with both concepts covered, we can agree that a singularity is a convergence. The technological singularity is when advanced tech converges to a cascading point of no return, and a gravitational singularity is where gravitational forces converge. Vivi Fluorite Eyes song, the anime, can also be viewed as a convergence, because it is somewhat difficult to pinpoint the genre of this anime. It has lovely music and idol scenes, as Vivi is actually known as Diva at her original production. Her true purpose is to make people happy with her singing. The anime does not shy away from this, it boasts beautiful animated stage singing sequences with wonderful original songs. When Devo is carrying out the singularity project as Vivi, the anime turns into a spectacular action show, comparable to Ghost in the Shell with action scenes animated to be on par with some of the best we have seen in the medium. The anime is episodic but still has a tightly bound plot that spans a hundred years. It is science fiction but prefers to focus on the human elements of the story. Vivi's creator made her with a question. What does it mean to pour your heart into something? Vivi spends all 100 years seeking the answer to this question so that she can pour her heart into her singing. The anime also has a heavy focus on the relationships Vivi has both as Devo and while carrying out the Singularity project. She relates to AI and humans alike and develops genuine bonds with both. She also has a very distinctive personality, kinda dry but curious and earnest. She also has some dry humor that got a chuckle out of me every now and then. <laughs> At some point during the 100 year run of the plot, the AI archive determined that the next natural step for human evolution is their replacement by the AI. 
The viewer is actually able to understand this viewpoint because of our parasocial relationship with Vivi. She's very human in all the ways that matter, with none of the inefficiencies. The deciding factor for the archive to determine that the AI are ready to replace the humans was Vivi's writing of an original song, the Fluorite Eyes song. The song is about her 100 year quest to save humanity and answer her question left by her creator. Similar to Doctor Who, the question is also the answer. The song revealed that the AI were capable of artistry and therefore fit to replace humanity. The full title of the anime is Vivi Fluorite Eyes Song. The true meaning of the title for the anime is never revealed, but we can take a gander. Calcium fluoride is the primary mineral used in the production of camera lenses. This serves as the basis for the AI optics. So the title could literally just be saying an AI song, seeing as it is written and sung by an AI. But let's go deeper. Calcium fluoride in a pure state is actually colorless, but when impurities are introduced it changes colors. The anime shows detailed rendering of Vivi's eyes throughout, and oftentimes we see a large spectrum of colors reflected in her eyes. This is telling us how she is taking in the impurity of the world around her and learning on her journey. She is being changed by her experiences and memories. So, in a way, the anime is saying that the Fluorite Eyes song expressed in the title is the true technological singularity. This is the point where humans are no longer necessary, and society begins to change drastically as the AIs take over. Congruent with the Penrose singularity, the moments after the song is also technically the end of time, as with humans eradicated, AI do not struggle with mortality and therefore will not be affected by the passage of time in a traditional sense. This to me is the true meaning behind this masterpiece of an anime that is Vivi Fluorite Eyes Song. Thanks for watching today. Please like and subscribe and see you again.